This video will cover questions regarding the topic of similar properties in right triangles. x squared equals 3 times 5, which is 15, then x equals square root of 15. y squared equals 3 times 2, which is 6. Then y equals square root of 6. z squared equals 2 times 5, which is 10. Then z equals square root of 10. From now on, let's find the answer quickly using formulas, then without formulas. Question 1. Use formula number 1 a squared equals xz, that means a squared equals x times z, then 6 squared equals 4 times x, then 36 equals 4x, then divide by 4 on each side, x equals 9. Now, shall we solve it without the formula? Let's say the angles here are e, and f. We know e plus f equals 90 degrees. That means this angle is 90, so this one is also e, because angle BAC is 90 degrees. And this angle e plus angle c is also 90 degrees. So we can say f here. The original one is here, then side is 6 and x, angle E and F. And let's draw triangle ABD. Changing it to a shape similar to original triangle ABC. So right angle, this part is D, angle E means vertex B, then angle F means vertex A, and BD is 4, BA is 6. So these two triangles are similar. Now we can compare very quickly 6 over X equals 4 over 6. Then cross multiply, 4x equals 36. Now we get the same equation we found in the beginning. Then of course the answer will be the same. So divide by 4 on each side, x equals 9. Question 2. Use formula number 2. b squared equals x times y. b squared equals x times y. Then x squared equals 3 times 12. Then x squared equals 36. Then x equals 6 or minus 6. But reject because x is always positive. Therefore, x equals 6. Now, shall we solve it without the formula? To make it easier to understand, I will layer the vertices and angles. Let's say A, B, right angles, and C. And the angles E, F, E, and F. And we already know angle E plus F equals 90 degrees. First, draw triangle DBC. D, B, C, and the label X, the angle E and F, and 12. Then draw triangle ABD, changing it to a shape similar to D, B, C. So, the right angle, angle E and F, the right angle is D, then angle E, that means vertex A, 
angle F, that means vertex B. Then AD is 3, BD is X. Then these two triangles are similar. Then X over 12 equals 3 over X. Then cross multiply x squared equals 36. So we get the same equation. Then x equals 6. Because x is always positive. Question 3. Use formula number 4. ac equals bz. And in here, 3 times 4 equals 5 times x. Then divide by 5 on each side. x equals 12 over 5. Now, we will solve it without the formula. The area of the first triangle is 3 times 4 divided by 2 2 times 1, 2 times 2, which is 6. And the area of the second one is 5 times x divided by 2, then 5x over 2. Then these two triangles are the same. That means 6 equals 5x over 2. Then make a fraction, then cross multiply, then 5x equals 12. Then divide by 5 on each side, x equals 12 over 5. Now we have the same answer. This is the last one. Now let's check whether you have completely memorized the formulas. The first one, a squared is x times z. Then a squared equals 5 times 8 which is 40, then a equals square root of 40, then square root of 4 times 10, final answer is 2 square root of 10. The second one, b squared equals x times y, b squared equals x times y, then b squared equals 5 times 3, which is 15, then b equals the square root of 15. Then formula 3. c squared equals y times z. Then c squared equals 3 times. z part is 8, which is 24. Then c equals the square root of 24. Then square root of 4 times 6, which is 2 square root of 6. I hope this video has been helpful. If you have any questions, leave them in the comment below. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe for more.